Alright, this is the other wheel that I'm putting on my 140. I took it off the tractor. This block broke out. I gotta take it out to replace them pins, the, the bolts in the block. The bolts sit on there. So I need to knock it off the wheel and roll the tire off. For the people who can't get the tire come off the wheel, that's the worst part of messing with a tire, a tractor tire. Yeah, it's getting it off the wheel. If you don't, your tools can be expensive. If you only go, if you only gonna need it once every two or three years, it ain't worth really buying the tools. And if you're going to um, tire shop, it's really expensive because they really don't want to fool with them either. Because it's all manual, you know, vehicle tires. They basically use a machine to take them on and off the wheel with. These tractor trailer tires and tractor tires are all hand done. They have a hammer, a big like a wood split maul. With like a uh, 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 grubbing hoe head on it, hit it, knock it off, and then they got a slide hammer one too. The tap 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 goes in here like a slide hammer, knock them on the wheel. This is something I done at the house. This is Super H. These tractors have damn damn pressure. Put your lock on there. It will bend your bar. Being careful. See a piece of metal under there. Just like that there. Give you a little demonstration on what it does. This is my, my sub. I had it back tracked up on blocks. I beat on that with the big, with a 10 pound hammer and didn't budget. All I do is need, need to get rolled it off the wheel enough to get that block fixed. But, uh, let me... all, all, all you're doing is, look right there. I had to work it out, work it most of the way, but halfway to get it there. But um, I painted one of the wheels silver, sitting outside in the sun. I'm getting ready. I gotta fix this block before I can paint this one and put it back on. But uh, one point, that, this is the Super A's got a uh, three point hitch on it. That's my uh, single shank sub solar. And it stuck this piece of metal. Like I said, it won't high enough to get up under the tire, so I backed it under some 4 by 4s and had to wipe the block the front wheels up so it don't roll off of them to make it tall enough to get the tire under it. But that works pretty good. Ain't a whole lot of labor involved. And to push it right on off of there. Any of your farm malls with damn pressure, you can sub sole or some, some solid and put you a piece of steel under there. And that'll push it right on off the wheel. And then you roll it on off. I'm going to share that to help anyone trying to knock the track. That's the worst part, to getting it to break off, the, the bead to break off of this rusty wheel. That's the worst part of messing with these tractor tires. All right, thanks for watching.